Hello there ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kyle Thompson. Today, we will be doing something a little bit different from last time. Um, we're going to be looking into the history of a television character. Now, you're probably wondering who is this person? And you probably have read the title, it's Mr. Blobby. It's Mr. Blobby, it's... It's this thing that it's one of the most creepiest things that we have ever done honestly honestly why am i doing this again because i have nothing else to do that's that's it well i guess we'll get started to find out where mr blobby came from you need to figure out what this thing is for those who don't know, Mr. Blobby is this inflatable pink figure with yellow spots and a massive grin with cold staring eyes, staring deep into your soul. Ugh. Mr. Blobby only communicates with the word Blobby that has changed electronicity. It is the creepiest thing ever. Now that we know what it is, we can finally figure out who made this. The answer may surprise you. So Mr. Blobby was created by writer Charlie Adams and it was written for a show called Nose House Party. Now, if that name sounds familiar, let me play you a little clip. Roll it. Hey, huh? Where's Edmunds? Good luck, darlings. Come in. It's quite funny that the deal or no deal guy created Mr. Blobby. It's Ludicrous, but yes, he is the deal or no deal guy, at least here in Britain. Um, that makes this thing a hundred times funnier. Anyway, there was a segment called Gotcha, where celebrities would meet Mr. Blobby as if he was a children's TV character. In fact, prior to 1982, Mr. Blobby didn't even exist. Mr. Blobby would cause a catastrophe on set before Noel Edmund showed himself. Also, did you know that the original Mr. Blobby was portrayed by a Scotsman? That makes me more terrified, I don't like that. After being in the gotcha segments, Mr. Blobby kept up appearances in Noel's house party, and even then, he kept on going. He had the number one single in the UK, which you're currently watching the music video on, and also, he had his own TV show in Denmark. Um, unfortunately, it got only six episodes in the 13-episode series. Um, he cameoed in tons of TV shows. He even got a video game for, like, the MS-DOS or something. That is amazing to me. So, yeah, that's Mr. Blobby. That's his entire history. It's really weird to see this inflatable pink thing as one of the greatest British things ever and he was only made as a prank and it's so amazing that he's became this cultural phenomenon um and it's just funny it's just funny look at him look at his face he scared the living daylights out of me thank you for watching this was a really fun video to research about mr blobby it was just fun to make as well it was just nice just to chill out right and it's just fun making these they're that back into YouTube. Um thank you for watching. Click all the buttons below and stay safe, stay cool, and goodbye.